everyone, so this is going to be a haul from Ollie's. I went to Ollie's today, it's right beside Goodwill. I love going there mainly to look at their food stuff because they always have really cheap food there. Um, but also I sometimes find good beauty related finds. So I did, I found a couple of things and I want to show you guys what I got. Um, the first thing, very boring, I got a pack of Kleenex pocket tissues and there are... There are 10 um, packs of pocket tissues in here, and they were only $1.99. Um, typically, I sometimes get pocket tissues at the Dollar Tree, and they're kind of like a cheaper brand that aren't very soft. Um, and, you know, it's a dollar for like maybe six of them. So this is definitely, you know, a pretty good deal if you're looking for pocket tissues. I like these not only for purses, but I also like to take them to work because it's really cold and my nose is like always running when I'm cold so I got those boring um, I found my dog a toy and this is of um, a duck but it's kind of like leopard printed which I thought was kind of cool uh, it's just like, all different colors and this was $2.99 and she loves the flat toys and this does have a squeaker in. I'm not going to squeak it because I don't want her to know I got it. Because I'm going to put this in her Christmas stocking this year. And she just loves tugging on these types of toys. She's a very small dog. But she loves things that are bigger than she is. I don't know. But I got that for her. I thought that was really cute. I found... I found... Okay... My last Ollie's haul, I had gotten um, some face wipes, and they had other ones there this time that were actually in like a gift set. You got three different kinds for like $2.99, which is a really good deal, and I was going to get one, but I wasn't like blown away with the ones that I had gotten last time, so I didn't. But, you know, if you have an Ollie's near you, that's an idea, maybe like for a gift for someone. And... I feel like there was something else there that was a good deal, but I can't remember what it was. But anyway, I found these, which were a good deal. Um, these are by a brand called Sammy, and they are... It's called Fun Fiber Shampoo and Fun Fiber Conditioner. The packaging is really cute. It's just a shampoo and conditioner. These were $1.79 a piece. And it basically says it creates fullness, density, and lift. Uh, because it's got like fiber and stuff in it. So I thought I'd give it a try since they were so cheap. Um, I'm kind of stocking up on shampoo now here. Because I've been finding it for uber cheap at thrift stores and now Ollie's. So I thought I'd give these a try. If you guys want a review on them, just let me know. I always want to do reviews on things. And I sometimes will get some done. And then other times, like, I don't know. Just winter has me so... I get depressed and my anxiety just gets the best of me a lot when the weather is so cold. I think just because I feel cooped up in my house and I hate going out because it's freezing all the time and it just sucks. So I am so ready for winter to be over and it just started so that's no fun. The rest of the stuff though that I got are all food related items so you know if you're not interested in watching this then I'd click out now. But I found some good things, so I want to show you what I found. The first thing I got was this Oat Revolution Oatmeal, and I've had this stuff before. It is very good. I've had the apple cinnamon. Uh, I wanted to try this kind, though. This is the strawberries and cream kind, and these are only 99 cents. You get five pouches, so I definitely suggest this brand um, if you are looking for an, a good tasting oatmeal, and it's cheap, too. So I got that. I got this little box of Cheez-Its, and these are the white cheddar Cheez-Its. It's a really cute tiny box. This was $0.69. Cents. Um, this would be perfect to take in my lunches for work. I love white cheddar. So I got that. I got this. I've never seen this before. I mean, I know this isn't like new or anything, but when I buy a shake and bake, I always buy just a regular like breaded shake and bake for chicken. This, however, is a teriyaki glaze shake and bake. And this was only 99 cents. So I figured we make a lot of chicken 
and we're always like trying to find different ways of making it because we have a chest freezer so we'll buy chicken when it's like buy one get one and then freeze a lot of it and then we'll just like get different recipes to like make the chicken so I thought this would be a good idea for um to use with the chicken at some point that was 99 cents um I found this Betty Crocker cornbread and muffin mix and I've made this before it's pretty good and this was only 79 cents so that's a good deal and always just check um the expiration dates when you buy food at Ollie's, sometimes they are getting near their expiration dates. Um, for the most part, you don't really see the expired stuff. The expired stuff, they sometimes will still sell, but it will be on like the end of an aisle and it will be like drastically reduced. So, but just always check. Normally I've never had a problem. A lot of this stuff lasts for like a while, while. Some things are good until like next year, so. I got a bag of hers potato chips and these are the ketchup kind I absolutely love weird tasting uh, potato chips I prefer weird tasting potato chips over regular potato chips um, these are for $1.89 so I definitely like those and then last but not least I got these uh, truffle cookies they're milk chocolate topped cookie with creamy caramel filling and these were $1.99. Uh, they're by a brand called Wolfgang, which is a local, um, like, chocolatier that in, like, the town that I live in. So I don't know how widespread the Wolfgang brand is. However, like I said, it's local here. So I got those. They look really good, and I've always liked Wolfgang candies. So got them. And then I have a little funny story. When we were leaving... I was being a total child and I decided I wanted something out of the little uh, quarter gumball type machines. Um, so they had a machine that sold like the little voodoo doll things and they weren't like the nice voodoo dolls like you can get it like five and below and stuff like that. But I still wanted one so I put 50 cents in the damn thing and this little like Dalmatian dog this little Dalmatian dog came out of the machine, and I was so angry. I was like, this isn't even on the, uh, like, the picture on the thing. So I put another 50 cents. So I paid a dollar for this voodoo doll. I mean, he's cute, though. It's just a blue one. It looks like this. I don't know. He's cute, but, I mean, I really didn't want to pay a dollar for him. I thought he was only going to be 50 cents, but I will hang him up somewhere because I thought he was cute, so... So I don't know about all this extra yarn right here. I kind of just wish it wasn't there. I might have to cut it off. I mean, I'm guessing it's supposed to resemble, like, hair or something. But I'd rather it just not be there. But I'm rambling now. Anyway, that is my Ollie's haul. I hope you guys liked it. And uh, before I leave, if I don't have another video up for the remainder of the evening, I just want to wish everyone a happy Thanksgiving. And I hope you guys have a nice Thanksgiving. I'm very excited to go shopping on Black Friday. I will definitely have a Black Friday shopping haul. Um, I'm going out with my parents and my boyfriend. So, I don't know. We'll see what I find. I'm not really in the search for anything too particular. But just, you know, whatever catches my eye. I need to check out the ads tomorrow um, before dinner starts. So, Anyway, happy Thanksgiving, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.